Yeah, I was a huge horror fan. Um, I think when I read the script, I loved the sort of ode to the classic slasher movies. Um, and honestly, just getting to work with Eli, he's he's been incredible. And also this character had so much to do. And I was so excited at, at the idea um, of getting to play that and, and go through all those emotions. And it's kind of like a dream. So it's been it's been pretty great. Eli is a 10 year old boy in a grown man form. So he is the most by far passionate director I've ever worked with. Um, and he's so collaborative. He came to us to start rehearsals way before we even started filming just to get the group sort of familiar with one another and have everything feeling natural. And, and he's also, he really gives the actors the space to do their best work. I have a lot of traumatic uh, moments and emotional sort of journey and, and he is always so great about giving you the time to do it. In this movie, we kind of have this amazing starting point of this event that happens uh, and then it continues to sort of escalate throughout it. So it has all these different elements where it's not just amazing horror and gore, but it also has that very real uh, sort of element to it, which I think is great. We got close real quick, to be quite honest. Um, it was great to have the rehearsals in the beginning, but I don't know how, but we all sort of feel like we've known each other forever and we've gone through some stuff together, you know, screaming and running and crying and whatnot. So everyone pretty much is with, I think like every second of the day, we're kind of with each other. We go home and we all stay at the same hotel and we come over and Addison usually orders a bunch of food and then, you know, the boys put on their music and it's, it's great, so I, I think, I hope that translates on screen. There are so many great things when, when we see this. I'm so excited to go to a theater and get to watch it. Um, there are huge, you know, gory scenes, that classic slasher scene, and then there's also sort of a bit of like a psychological thriller element to it. Um, he, he, Eli has a great way of building up to these moments and you can sort of see like these different elements of betrayal and revenge and real, very real things and emotions. And then that coupled with the larger than life gore and action is crazy. I mean, I wasn't anticipating doing all of the action that I actually did but from like running through a forest to, you know, falling over a desk or having a fight with someone, loading a gun, um, explosions, it, it just kind of has everything to be honest.